April is recognized as Autism Awareness Month, and today more than 15 schools from Pennsylvania visited the Commonwealth Technical Institute at Johnstown's Hiram G. Andrews Center. The center, located in Johnstown, held an acceptance walk for students and teachers. Arlena Wells was there and shows us the impact of this event. This year's Autism Walk and Resource Fair gives students the chance to explore the opportunities that await them outside of the classroom. But more importantly, it teaches them to accept each other. This is a place to just celebrate anyone who's on the spectrum, whether you are an individual or you know someone, you have a family member. Um, we're all technically on the spectrum in some fashion or another, and that's why it's called a spectrum. Um, so today is just a day for everyone to get together and um, celebrate. This is the seventh year that CTI has held the event, and they use it to showcase their support services and programs that they offer to people of all backgrounds and abilities. Everyone deserves an opportunity and that opportunities are beautiful things and that we want to support families and we want to support people on the spectrum and we just want to make sure that everybody's able to dream big dreams about their future and that we're able to stand them up and support them in every way possible. And the teachers who work with students each day say it's never too early for them to think about their future. My kids are kindergarten to sixth grade. That's our classroom and the classes that we have here today. Um, maybe they're not going to be doing that in the next few years, but it's nice for them to see that there are opportunities for them in the future. And for the older kids, they're really getting hands-on experience and ideas of something that they could do moving forward in the very near future. And the Institute wants you to remember that autism awareness isn't only in April. I want everyone to know that individuals on the spectrum are um, talented, valuable individuals who can contribute to our community, to our workplaces, um, and that the, the center here provides the supports to help them and really anyone. Reporting in Johnstown, Leanna Wells, WTAJ News.